I do believe we can be strong pillars in the uh, Africa free trade arrangement and take a, a leading role in, in, in opening up this continent. And I really look forward to seeing how we can all work together to strengthen this partnership between our two countries. We are two countries, I believe, that are important in our respective uh, uh, um, regions. And I believe our close collaboration is useful not just for uh, our own countries, but also for our respective regions, especially at this time when we are facing such uh, intense challenges. Uh, we have the COVID that is uh, uh, affecting us. And uh, I believe our close collaboration and mutual cooperation on all these matters is, 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 is of mutual interest to us. The stability of our respective regions and ultimately the stability of our continent, which is essential for our prosperity. Both our airlines are struggling given the current uh, uh, global environment. We need them to survive and we also need to ensure that uh, they do survive so that our airspace does not become an airspace that is controlled and dominated by non-African airlines and then we are ultimately dependent on others for our own travel within our own continent. I know our ministries uh, are, are working together on that. I know uh, our respective airline um, Managements are working and collaborating closely, so that's an area I believe we can strongly, strongly advance. Exchanging ideas, exchanging experiences, working together to pass on experiences to our colleagues across the continent. I do believe that that is also, as you have just said, equally, equally as important. I'm also really looking forward in the not too distant future and hopefully we'll be able to use that opportunity to cement some of these issues that uh, you have uh, been discussing uh, when when i make uh, a state visit in return to the one that was made by president zuma a few years ago it's been long overdue as a result of covid and i do hope that uh, we will be able to 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 actually have that happen and use that as an occasion to further cement and deepen and elevate the uh, JCC to the uh, leaders of our two respective countries and to show the importance of our partnership uh, going forward. I want to also take this opportunity through you once again to pass on um, my appreciation for the leadership role that uh, President Ramaphosa took on last year in his role as chair of the uh, African Union, where we made tremendous progress. And I don't think Africa has moved so united and so rapidly in terms of our response to this particular pandemic. So, so I'm, I'm very keen to also see that deepening partnership and we've been working and talking. You've taken a lead with uh, Aspen Pharma, and uh, we're hoping to collaborate in that area to ensure that not just for this pandemic, but also for future pandemics, we are better able now to follow through on uh, the actions that we take by also ensuring that we're also able to give our people the vaccines without having to depend on third parties who end up letting us down in the long term. So this is, this is something that I'm also very keen to see us continuing to, to, to collaborate and for us to, to use this as, as an example of what should never again happen you know, on our continent. We are prepared, we are ready, we are engaged, we know what we need to do going into the future and we need to be able to arm ourselves to ensure that we are able to see the whole process through. So that again is an area I really would be very keen to see us continue and deepen our collaboration. Excited. Very excited to 